Hello everyone and welcome to the video tutorial of OpenCard Progressive Web Application. Now, Progressive Web Application uses web compatibilities and provides an application experience to the user. It develops from a browser tab and makes pages more immersive with a low friction user experience. The Progressive Web Application is lightning fast as compared to the website and supports push notification as well. Now, according to a Google report, Flipkart, which is India's largest e-commerce site, decided to combine their web presence and native app into a progressive web application that has resulted in a 70% increase in conversion. And you can refer to the link which we have provided in the user guide. So, with the use of this feature, the website works faster on a slow internet connection. Due to the faster performance, the user engagement increases on the site and results in a very high conversion rate. Now, the best part of Progressive Web Application is that a user can use many of the features without an internet connection. And once the mobile is connected to the internet, the data gets synced. In short, you can say that if you are providing a platform to your user which is user friendly and faster then it will definitely increase the engagement of the user and increase in sale so for the better understanding about the module you can refer to the user guide now let's come to the installation of this module now for the installation you will be having the zip file of the module and inside the zip file you will be getting four folders namely admin catalog image and oc emoji now you just need to upload the admin catalog and image folder into your open car to do directory and then you are done with the installation part now let's move to the configuration of this module now this is my admin panel so after uploading the folders that is admin catalog and image into your open card root directory you will come to the open card backend now go to extension and extension installer now here you will upload the xml file and the xml file can be found inside the oc mode folder so you have to click here to upload the xml file after uploading the xml file you have to go to modification and then you have to refresh now you have to go to uh, system and under system you have to go to user and under user you will be getting user group so just click on user group and then you have to select administrator so click on the edit button now you have to select the access permission from here whatever you want to select and modify permission from here and then you have to save now after saving again we will go to extension and then we will go to modules and now you can see web cool progressive web application so from here you can uninstall the module and from here you can configure or edit the module so click on this edit button so now from here you can enable the status as enable or disable now you can write the application name you can write applications short name from here you can upload the icon application icon which will be displayed on your phone you can select the splash background color as green you can select application header color as this whatever you need you can select from here custom home page background color custom home page font color and then you can save your settings now after saving the setting you can see the message success you have modified web cool progressive web application module now we will see how this particular module works on your smartphone